In this tutorial, we're going to be looking at the Live Stats software. This can be accessed in two ways. You can subscribe to the CDMBet Live Stats software, which is available to download as a standalone. Alternatively, if you're a VIP member, you can have the Live Stats integrated into your current software. So once you open up the Live Stats software, from left to right, you have the league, the current state of time, the league round, the data column showing if the match has data highlighted in green, the home team and if the home team has any red cards, the away team if the away team has any red cards, the similar number of games based on the ELO value, the current score and then the games with the same score and the same minute and then the home draw away, the over, the under percentages which can also be changed to odds then the percentage of the home or away team to score within a certain time frame and then the three most probable scores at full time. Now let's take a look at the bottom control panel. First we have the leagues to be considered and by default all leagues are selected however you can customise your leagues. Next we can select the ELO range to be considered and the current default is 75. You can also choose to select similar games from the current league or from all games if the ELO number is less than 100. You can also choose to see extra data at the side of the team names. In the calculations section you can control what columns you'd like to be displayed. You can also assign handicaps to the teams and the over and under markets from 0.5 to 4.5. You can also edit the time frame for the next team to score column. And finally we can add the data for the three most probable scores. In the next section we can switch between percentage and odds, full time, half time or minute. The full time if the home team scores in a certain amount of minutes, the same for the away or after a certain amount of minutes. And you can also highlight games in yellow if the offered odds by the bookmaker are higher than the calculated odds, providing the sample size of the games is over 100. This would signify a value bet opportunity. By default, the page will automatically refresh every 30 seconds, but you can disable this and you can refresh manually. Now let's take a look at some examples and how we can tweak the settings to give different results. So first let's change from percentage to odds and let's check the box to include the most three probable scores. The more columns you calculate, the longer it will take for the data to refresh. Now if we scroll across to the right, we can now fully see the top three likely scores. These scores are based on the most likely scores from the sample games, taking into consideration the current time and score. Now let's take a look at what happens to the odds when we consider games from the league only. And then from all games if the number of ELO games is less than 100. Now let's take a look at what happens when we change the home or the way team to score to the next 10 minutes. We can also see a number of teams highlighted in yellow. This is where the offered odds by the bookmaker is higher than the calculated odds. If we take the draw odds for Liege vs Royal Moosecon for example, the bookmaker is offering 2.9, but the calculated odds suggest it should be 2.23, which presents a value bet opportunity. And in the end, this game did in fact finish a draw. The CGM Livestats software is an extremely powerful tool and is constantly being updated with new features and functions. And for information on the latest updates, head over to cgmbet.com forward slash forum. This concludes a live stats tutorial.